All right, all right, all right, here we go. This was a blockbuster game. You know, Jose Mourinho back to the footballing world uh, against a massive, massive rival club and facing Chelsea for the first time back in football after having so much success for, for us uh, during his time twice in our club. And now he was back uh, with Tottenham Hotspurs and Spurs at their home ground. You know, this was going to be a very, very big, big match. You know, we've had a very, very up and down season up until that point. We win one, we lose one, we draw one. Just before this match, we played against Bournemouth and uh, we lost. So this was a must, must win game. We played with the 3-4-3, uh, as you will see, Alonso featuring uh, as, as in the left wing back sometime in this clip. Uh, for some reason, Jose really, really struggles in the 3-4-3. So as the match went on, we applied a lot of pressure uh, to go on with, plenty of corners. The second corner of the match, William takes a short corner, Kovacic passes it back and William absolutely terrifies Sergio and rips in a ripper of a shot and it was a fantastic fantastic strike one of the one of the goals uh, of the season for Chelsea I would say and as the match went on we applied more and more pe pressure uh, as you can see Alonso you know really really doing well in the left wing back position Mount had a really excellent game as well plenty of opportunities but we just couldn't capitalize Spurs slowly started to come into the game. They had a pretty decent lineup as well with Harry Kane, Son, uh, Ali, so many of their players playing, and they were they were slowly coming into the game, uh, threatening uh, in most chances as well, but just couldn't find the back of the net at their home ground. Um, this was a very very uh, dangerous play here. You know, Alonso put Kepa in an absolute stress. Luckily, Kepa came out with uh, no injuries and uh, it was okay. But, you know, these are the type of plays that Alonso sometimes plays, which, which just terrifies the fans. But nonetheless, Kepa had a very good game at halftime, 1-0. Uh, it was really, really good for Chelsea. And, um, yeah, there was a penalty penalty opportunity just before halftime. God, I completely forgot about that. Yes, William was the one who took it. And it was his second goal of the match, coolly taken and absolutely nicely slotted away. As I said, Williams, one of his best games I've seen under Chelsea Colors, his passing, his movement, his running, everything was so sublime. And um, as the match went on, I think, here we go, I think that's that's first half finished. A very, very convincing scoreline at first half, 2-0, uh, just what dreams are made of, to be honest, away from home. And uh, against Jose Mourinho, that would have been oh so beautiful. Tottenham obviously came second half, all guns blazing. They, they needed to make, you know, uh, needed to change the vibe of the game because they're behind. But we, we, we stuck in there. We weathered the storm and then we continued on and then there were more chances, um, you know, just a miscommunication there between Tammy Abraham and Mason Mount. But... but but the pressure was coming on. And uh, here we go, Tammy again, one more time, hitting the byline and crosses it way across. Uh, no one there, unfortunately. Willian was uh, lurking open, just couldn't get to him. Here we go, Willian again, as I said, he had a fantastic match. He's, he was just terrifying the Tottenham defense, not in that occasion, but there we go. Alonso with that left wing back situation where he can, you know, drive up and score uh, at any time in this case obviously the shot was saved but Tammy was there to mop it up however VAR has ruled that offside and now this is this was the controversial situation where Son was given a red card uh, as you can see here slight touch and then Son lashes out uh, really good look he does make a meal of it nonetheless red card and at that point it was pretty much, I'd say, over. You know, two 0 down, red card. Jorginho comes on as well to to completely take over the match, and we really should have scored more in that match. To be honest, Batshuayi, here we go with the ball. I'm sure he's he's gonna probably stuff it up. No, it was a good shot, uh, just missed. So yeah, we we it should have been way more than two. Frank was definitely animated in that match. He he wanted he wanted to prove uh, that you know Chelsea and there to to win the big matches as well they don't just you know, we were struggling that this season to win the big matches against big clubs and um, this was this was oh so special as you can see it means a lot to 
the Chelsea fans as well. And a fantastic victory. The way we finished it off 2-0, commanding victory. As you can see, the lads so, so happy. Kepa, clean sheet as well, which was very, very rare this season for us. And um, yeah, lots of, lots of great, great energy there. Look at Tomori, Rudiger and Frank. Here we go, starting the party. Come on, everybody. Come on, jump. Let's get it going. Yes. Yes. That's what it means to him. Uh, that's, that's a big win, win against Tottenham and a big, big win against Jose Mourinho. Student teaches the master. And uh, as you can see, Tammy, Tammy is uh, very, very excited as well. Frank's so excited, gives his jacket away. Thank you, Frank. Thank you for that. And that's all.